Welcome all to what is the first of the group stage fixtures of the Europa League. I think we're just about ready to get going here. A warm welcome to you wherever you are in the world. I'm your commentator, Peter Drury, and providing his unique brand of expert analysis, here's Jim Beckley. Well, I can tell you, I'm truly delighted to join you, Peter, and, and thank you very much for that. The strains of the now familiar Europa League anthem as the players stand in line. The lineups for the game. So that's got things on the way. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Callejon, he's the one who could shine. Um, sharp and skillful and happy to ease inside and allowing the fullback to fill the space he vacates. If an opportunity arises too, he's also a very mean free kick taker. Yes, they'll certainly be leaning heavily on him. Shelley. Ramsey. Milik. That's been intercepted and that will come to nothing. The Lacazette. Just brushed off the ball there. Napoli have it back and they can go again. Forward it goes. It's a Babian. Could move up a gear here. Peter, we can only applaud that quality of tackle in the circumstances. It was probably goal saving. Now it's Mertens. Milik! Big relief. It just needed better contact. Well, Peter, he clearly felt he was being invited to shoot, and it wasn't the worst decision he could have made. Napoli have really got the wind in their sails. And I'm not sure whether this team has an anchor. Koscielny. Hector Bellerin. Lacazette. Has it out wide now. In comes the delivery. Danger averted for now. Arsenal, anything, Jim, to pick out of these early exchanges? For Pastathopoulos. And it's Shaka. He'll hit it! Keeper's not concerned by that. Well, I think a little eagerness just got the better of him. He may have been thinking about back-page headlines there. Jaka with a delicate ball, and he just whacks it away.
Now it's Shaka. Who's he going to play in? Good take by the keeper, he's read that well. Kolasinac goes up and over. That's put paid to a promising move. Milik. Oh, some clever movement up front. Yeah, they're playing with a, a false nine, and no one's really holding a fixed position up there. How does that work? Well, I think it's an attempt to just confuse this defence with, with constant interchange and, and different movement. Granit Xhaka. Looks to clip it forward. Kai Hon looking to get on the end of this. Can he put it away? Fair effort, he reacted well. He had a good feel of the, the whole situation and he's acknowledged the service. Kolasinac. Mertens. Hamshik plays it forward. Lacazette and it's Kolasinac tries a through ball now it's Obamia he's left his man and the shot last ditch defending but that'll do Ramsey Defense got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Well, the further he... It's Ramsey! Oh, great save, real class. Tries his luck. It didn't come off, but an audacious effort. Well, it was certainly an acrobatic effort. I mean, it was probably the best option for him, but they're never easy to pull off. And it's been taken short. Obama Yang. Oh, that is lovely footwork. The shot's on! Promising move that good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Shaka Obama Yang goes steaming forward. He's got away. Obama Yang has a swing at it. He's got away with one there. Played it short. Obama Yang. There are a few waiting for it. Tries lifting it over. And that's been levered clear. Chance to break. Now the pass. He's played him through. And it's Hamshik. Kaya Hon. Chip through. Now it's Kaya Hon, drilled in low. Timely intervention. And the whistle goes for half-time. So now the team has broken through, but certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goalless. So there was the first half. Arsenal ended that first half in such a strong fashion. I think we'll just have to wait and see now if they can rekindle that drive and that determination. It's been great commitment, and that has to be maintained in the second half. An intriguing half, lacking only in goals. The score, nil-nil. If you're just back from your break, you've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. 
Arsenal can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and purpose and can't afford to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. Kolasinac. Mustafi. Hamshik. Mertens. Granit Xhaka. Ramsey passes it through. And he's straight offside. He may have been caught offside, but... Well, Peter, from experience, defenders, I can tell you, hate those runs in behind. Gets it upfield. Allen. Nil-nil still. It's a game that needs a bit of life injected. And it's Mertens. And that's sprayed out wide. Floats one over. Kaya Hahn tries to get it forward quickly. Hampshire. Allen. Well into the second half, and still there's nothing between them. Gulan. Lorenzo Insigne goes for the cross. actually not getting too tight, which is interesting. No, it's probably cautionary. Uh, don't dive in, try to pinch it or, or intercept so nobody can get in behind. Milik going for goal! It's in! Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Napoli take the lead, 1-0. Look, experienced voices need to be heard now, along with good purpose and urgency, and they can get right back into this. Is there any support? He shoots! And in it goes! And with the match slipping away, they have hauled themselves off the canvas. Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. And that has added a whole new complexion to the game. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking... Oh, Bamiyang! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Oh, he really wanted that. Yeah, and you can feel and hear how the crowd are reacting to all of this.
They've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Kolesinac. Shaka. Little doubt. That is a foul. Bamiang is effectively being marked out of the game here. Listen, it's not nice and it's not clever, Peter, but it has to be done when he tries to make one of those telling runs. And it's Shaka. He's been bundled over, that is a foul. Well, you might think he got off lightly, it is just a verbal warning. Looks to me as though this is probably a little too far out for a shot. Shaka, ready to try one. Shaka! No attempt, just the wrong outcome. That's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. Napoli merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. And it's Kaya Hon. Socrates gets it back. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. He's had a shot! Fantastic from Aubameyang! And the game is well and truly turned on its head. Oh, look, it's always great to see a solo effort with a goal. It's the ideal combination of pace and control. Arsenal take the lead. I just think this has been a lesson in character, togetherness and composure. I think most teams would have crumbled by now, but this refusal to give up is brilliant. Ramsey. He's come loose. Went in for a slide tackle and executed it cleanly. Yeah, it's safe to say that they just need to manage this to secure the win now. And it's Kolasinac. Just a few more moments for them to hang on. And he's made certain that won't get through. And that's that. Hostel starts as they wanted to start. All three points, the first three points, crucially. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? Well, pressure can quickly build on you if a positive result isn't 